Hey, the Flysters, what's going on? It's me, it's Fancy Flo. Well, welcome to my little private nook. <laughs> Say hi, Bethany. Look at how growing, she's beautifully growing. Remember last time, she just had little tiny buds on her. So, I'm just here getting some sun water. Yeah, that's right, sun water. So what I like to do is fill up a big jug of filtered water and then leave it out in the sun for about 12 hours so that it gets all those beautiful DNA activation light codes from Father Sun. Really great for your health, mind, body, rejuvenation. I also leave it out in the night sometimes and make moon water, which is also a great activation code. So as you know, this week, our theme was water. Water is very important and vital to our lives. It's basically in everything, everything takes water. When our bodies are made up of 70% of water. Did you know that water can pick up on feelings and emotions? Now, because our bodies are made up of 70% of this water, it's very, very important that we speak very kindly to ourselves and to others because that, that energy is flowing through us. And if we're made mostly of water, if we talk down about ourselves, that water is gonna get thick and murky and no good. Here's something you can try at home. Fill up two glasses of water on one, put a message of I love you, thank you, you are wonderful, quite much like what I've done here with mine. I've written all these nice notes. Oh, that one smudged off a little bit. It says joy, peace, love. I truly appreciate you. I love you. Messages that say funny so we could have a good laughing time together. I've got messages, happy, protection, thank you, clean, and 5D water. And then on my water glass, I have, I love you, thank you. So you put one glass with these beautiful messages on it, and then you take another glass and you fill it, and you put not nice so messages. Maybe you even write, I hate you on it. Oh, it just feels so horrible to say. But you just, this is just for experiment. This is just for experimental purposes. So you, you talk mean to one glass. So maybe when you're feeling frustrated and upset or, or, or annoyed, maybe you go to that glass and you put your frustration out on that glass of water. And when you're feeling good and feeling joy and feeling love, which is most of the time, right? You talk to the happy glass of water. Watch that for about, I'm gonna say three days to a week and see the difference of the look of the water and show us your videos about it. I've noticed since I put these beautiful messages on my water bottle and my glass, and since I've been speaking nicely to water, the taste, crisp, clean, supreme. Now it's true, I do use a water filter, but I'm talking about since doing this from, from using a water filter, it's just magnificent. Kids between the ages of four and eight can suffice with four to eight glasses a day, 13 and up, eight and plus. I have been on a mission to try to drink one gallon of water a day. I haven't been fully successful, <laughs> but I'm still working on it and I never give up. You never lose unless you give up. So um, I've been trying to drink, so one full one of these a day, plus two more of these makes about a gallon. So I try to get one in a day. Now the first two to three days that I, that I started the challenge, um, I was successful at it. Um, and then my body just started, I don't know if it was alchemating to it or what, but I haven't given up. I still make sure this is full every day and I get my water in throughout the day. You know, as we get hotter and hotter in our weather, I think it's gonna be a lot easier to do so. Um, another thing we could do is to choose water as often as possible. So if you're gonna have a glass of, for every glass of juice, three cups of water. For every glass of juice, maybe you take half the juice and then the other half water. Water is literally 
life. We are made up of 70 to 80% of water, our bodies, ourselves. So we've got to fill this puppy up and keep her hydrated. Can you make it a goal to get in your eight glasses of water a day? Ah, so satisfying. You're tuned into McFly World. Yay!